Hey, Latros is doing some Enchanted Princess Journey on the Wii, the game in its entirety, because why not? The game I played when I was younger, really young, so I don't have any memory of this game, no recollection whatsoever, really. But it's a good break from all the Minecraft, and this is just a little refreshing disaster fest. I do like this game, it hasn't really aged well. Anyway, enjoy. If you have ultimate power, what are you doing? Raising squirrels? Me, someone very alone, female, going to meet uh, mice. Aren't we essentially killing a person's voice? <laughs> <laughs> what? It was Turtle Frog! Hi, it's Latros here. Ruined, ruined, restored. Oh, oh, okay. What the heck? Okay, the remote switched to the- they got two remotes here. The first one died, and then the second one that I, that I clicked to turn on, turned on the second one, and but the first one's dead, and the second one won't turn into the first one. Is there a way I could fix this, please? Can I- uh, how do I fix this? Back. That's just very weird. Ovak, Sky, Fish, who is a gentle haven? Oh god. That one was- Oh my god. If I take out the batteries of the first one, maybe the second one will identify as the first one. What if I switch the batteries on both the remotes? Okay, there we go. Oh, it's two now! You- Okay, now it's player one. It switches when I switch the battery packs to player one and two. Oh my god, I don't know how to fix this. What? And I put the working battery pack in the other remote, and then it tells me player one, and then it changes to two. What? Don't know how to fix this thing other than to turn off the game and turn it on again. A new game, one player, fish. Yes. Curious. The little girl followed the pixie toward an abandoned castle. Um. As they approached, the pixie explained that the castle was once the home of a young, beautiful princess. But an evil curse had been cast upon it. So why, why are you bringing the little girl into a castle of to curses? To return the castle to its former glory, a very special girl would have to undertake an enchanted journey across magical lands. Okay, but why does she have to be a literal child? Me. By helping these princesses, the spell would be broken. Cheesy. Oh, thank goodness. I'm so glad you remembered your name. That sounds sarcastic and condescending. Orange. <laughs> okay, we're not doing that one. That looks like you've had like rain poured on your hair. You look very wet in the head. Eyes red. Oh yeah. I do not think I need any more color clashing here. This is already a monstrosity to look at. I can't look at that. My brain hurts looking at that. Now there's one okay. really important thing I need to give you. Your magic wand. It's beautiful. What's the price of this wand? You can't just give me something, expect it not to come with ulterior motives. These troublemakers are responsible for all the bad stuff that's been happening at the castle. Now, the boss are actually captured butterflies who've been forced to cause mischief. What? And only your wand can set the butterflies free. Okay. I understand. No, no, don't. How does it work? Okay. Well, can we go back to the butterflies part? Do you want to skip the lessons? So, she's saying that the enslaved butterflies are to blame for everything in this world. But why are the butterflies enslaved? And why are we blaming the enslaved butterflies? <laughs> oh wait, shoot, I skipped the lesson! Oh, I was not supposed to skip the lesson. <laughs> Oops. I won't- Um, what do I do now? I've skipped the lesson. I'm lessonless and I got no idea what I'm doing. Can we- Oh. <laughs> I 
really hasn't been used in a while. But don't worry, it's a smooth ride to the bottom from here. Bottom? I wouldn't say this is bottom. This is hidden room. Well, here we are. Go ahead and look around. These are secret portals to the worlds of the princesses. The bogs you saw earlier are causing trouble in all of them. Your challenge is to help the princesses within each world. Once all the princesses' kingdoms are safe, our castle and our world will be restored. That's big pressure. World in any order. Big pressure on a child. Cinderella's world is rather difficult, but I know you can do it. Oh, little manipulative fairies got faith in me. Okay, they're freezing people. Butterflies can freeze people. How wonderful. It looks like time has been frozen throughout this land. What is wrong with my horse? He won't move. Okay. I was worried you were gonna be worried about, you know, this this wonderful man right here who's chopping wood who just can't move. But uh, if you're only worried about your horse, I got you. If that horse is valuable to you. What is wrong with my horse? I guess that horse is valuable to you. Okay, well, how do I how do I how do I stop this? How do I? My magic wand ain't doing squat. I'm using my magic on your ass. Start moving. I don't know what's going on. What? That didn't do anything? The magical burst did nothing? English. Wow. Why not? Why can't Cinderella get married? Nice, nice How did you get that from that? I delivered the invitations for you. Oh, that's a nice, nice. <laughs> what? Oh. Many thanks, young lady. I'd like to give you these gems to say thank you. Yes, give me money for saving your bum. Raccoon! So much cleaning to be done, so little time. Oh, well. I was talking to someone. Evil butterflies. Oh no! Those bombs are using their magic to hold the gate shut. Unless we get rid of the bombs, so evil butterflies have an agenda. Okay. More barrels. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know what that did. Perish my butterflies. I mean, I'm freeing the butterflies, haha. Okay, magic solves everything here. These problems are so simplified. Because it's not safe, little man. He was supposed to deliver the food for the wedding, but no one's seen or heard from him in so, so ominous. Such a help. Why, why am I volunteering? Just outside of town. Oh, I do hope you can find the farmer in time for the wedding. Bro, I think I think there are bigger problems than the wedding. Oh, little butterfly. Sorry. I gotta go check on someone who's gone missing. They legit sound like they say how you doing. They sound so evil, but in their hearts, they're just curious about how you're doing. <laughs> they just ask how you're doing, and then they hurt you. It's like, what the heck? Oh, oh, okay, okay, well, now I'm not curious anymore. Okay, stop, guys. Yes, money. I'll, I'll definitely help others with this money. Alright, let's go help the horse. Wait, 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 wait. So if I go up right here, they can't follow me? Oh, 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 oh they can. But if I go right here... If I stand right here, they all come. But if I go right here... 
These guys can freeze time itself, but cannot climb a curb. They can't climb a curb. But they can stop time. I gotta say. Interesting. Another squirrel. Interesting. I don't, I don't know how they cat like catch squirrels. Because they can't climb a curb, but they can catch a squirrel. I mean, the extent of their power is fully unknown, it seems. And they got a rabbit, too. You just can't catch those things. It just baffles me. These, They have the ultimate power to stop time, and they don't use it to their advantage. Go go stop your teacher from a... Well, I didn't hear what she said. Go stop your teacher from assigning your homework. Like, once she assigns it, you'll say, bring it the next day. I know. You'll probably realize, you know, time has passed since he's assigned it, but who is he to deny you when he's losing track of time? You could, you could make him think he's gone crazy. They did your homework, really. That's kind of mean, but, I mean... If you have ultimate power, what are you doing? Freezing squirrels! They just do senseless things! Somebody help! I prize pumpkins are being destroyed! Don't let any of them explode. If a pumpkin gets too big, use your magic to shrink it. Why are they caring about pumpkins and what? Protect a pumpkin. Save the farmer's crop from the bog. You make pumpkins explode? I gotta say, they have a sense of humor. I want to see them explode a pumpkin. Explode a pumpkin. Let me let me see it happen. You didn't even explode it. It just kind of turned green. What? You just made it bigger. Okay, guys, it's stop. It's time to stop. Oh. That's my time, I need to go. It's time to stop rampaging the pumpkins. Okay, so it's saved. I gotta go. Anyway. Oh gosh, as soon as I come back, I see this monstrosity. To see you, time is still acting strangely all over the kingdom. Speak? Oh my gosh, well, how do I... There we go. <laughs> it's a nice girl. <laughs> Please, nice girl. Have a nice money. Look up. Asa needs a help. Linda really had a old house looking for fairy god money. But Linda really gone too long. We should go to the manor and check on Cinderella. Translating. That's a good idea. What? How do I get to the manor, Jack? There's a forest. Gus Gus go too. All I heard was... <laughs> I've told oh, him so closely. It. Oh, Gus. There's nothing to be afraid of. I'll take you to the gate. Wait for me near the forest entrance, okay? Uh, yeah. Gus, Gus, wait. Say, Gus, Gus, need a girl at forest. <laughs> That's so disturbing. Oh, I can. Oh my gosh, I can be in slow motion. <gasps> Whoa. Wait, guys. Oh. 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 Actually, though. Oh, I'm supposed to go meet Gus in the forest. Me, someone very alone, female, going to meet uh, mice in the forest. Sounds absolutely wonderful. Wait, stop waving your stupid wand! Okay, there's the mice. <laughs> forest too scary. Lots of meanie greenies. Meanie greenies? Is that what he said? Gus will be much less frightened if you guard him on the way to the manor. Okay, it's time to start killing things, murdering the butterflies, stop time magically. Okay, stop attacking the poor mouse. The mouse deserves life. My bye, nice girl. <gasps> He's got his little door. Ah, uh, uh, you know what? You can just wait a second. I, I kind of want to go do things real quick. You can just wait in time. It's not like you're. What happened? Now I understand. You must have saved me. But how did you know to look for me here? Do you know where she might be? I think she's by the wishing well outside the kitchen. Wishing well by the kitchen. I'm gonna follow you. Oh, oh, okay. Well, no, never mind. I'm good. Here. Oh, dear. It seems the kitchen door's been sealed with magic. What? Well, we'll have to fix that if we're going to find my fairy god. <laughs> hmm. 
Now that's strange. This clock is the only one in the manor that's telling the correct time. Huh? Wonder if you what? fix the other three clocks, perhaps that you were frozen in time. Door. How do you know the time? The is set to 12. The clock oh, the this time. door is magically locked. Uh oh, so I can't go inside the door because it's locked. But that is just so odd to come to the conclusion that you have to change clocks. These mini games, though. Wait. This wand is so annoying. <laughs> oh, please stop. I. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Come on. Oh. Oh no! The bogs are stealing coins from the wishing well. And each coin is a wish someone made. You can get the coins back from the box if you use your magic to pick up the coins, and that will return them to the world. Coin collector, get the coins back from the box. They just run away! We're playing tag. Oh, okay. Well, beat this. Oh, this is a fair game of tag. This is a fair game of you steal my money, so I chase you down. And I turn you into magic butterflies. Oh! This is my fairy godmother. Okay, cool. Oh, but hello, fairy godmother. Trouble. Time is frozen everywhere, and everything. You go to her now? Oh dear, that is most. Troubling. Why didn't you ask her before? We haven't met yet. There is the explanation. Like the people in this world don't trust each other. It must be because of those mirage treasures. Mm. Your magic wand has the power to reveal the truth. One twirl of your wand will undo any mirage and show its true form. That will restore people's trust in one another. Why don't you try it on this cart of gold? Reveal what's in the cart. Use your magic on the cart of gold. Okay. It's not real gold. It's it's just a pile of dirt. Oh, I am so ashamed, my friend. Can't believe I was blinded by the treasure. Got about our friendship. <gasps> Me too, my friend. Thank you for showing us the truth, young lady. Oh, that's actually kind of cute that they just made up. That makes sense. People want money, so they fight. It makes complete sense, actually. I, I, this is actually the world that makes most sense to me so far. It's gold. Looks real to me. Oh wow! Boom. Dirt. Oh, oh! I like this world. Don't trust me, boy. I show you. I show you magic. Boom. Dirt. Will not be dishonest again. That I promise. They change so quickly. They change so quickly in dirt. And he's still, he's so happy now, I guess. I don't. Nash, boom, dirt. Oh, it's fish. Excuse me, are you Princess Jasmine? Oh, I didn't hear you come in. But yes. You have no security? So glad you're not a mirage. I'm so worried. Okay. I don't know what we're going to do. Damn. Maybe I can help. Bro, <laughs> she's so she's so blunt. Sure, but I'll do my best to help the people of Agrabah be honest and trustworthy. Monkey, I'm going to catch you because you need to help me with the problems in this village where people think they're rich but they're actually not. You think they get it at a certain point? But blind being blinded by money is the truth of this earth. You'll have to catch him and convince him to return that mirage gem. Find a boo in the marketplace. By the fruit, of course. This is this world is so similar to real life. I don't like it. It's like, okay, there's problems, it gets worse. A monkey's stealing your fruit. <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh, 
Okay, sorry. I'll turn it to dirt for you guys. I mean, this is how you get hated in society. You take away people's money. I mean, come on. Why? Why am I put in this role? I mean, if you just take away people, if you turn things the way they are, if everyone thinks they have money and then it looks like you're telling them, oh, you know, the truth. I took people out of the brain when I was younger, does not remember what this is exactly. Okay, monkey. I got you, Abu. Please give me back that gem. Oh, it's a gem, not watermelon. Okay. to learn to be honest. How can I trust you if you don't get back the gem? See, it's not even real. It was just a mirage. Come on, let's go see Princess Gems. <gasps> you can't even trust the gems! Princess Gems is waiting for you. You're gonna you're gonna earn some money from the shop one day when you when you earn that money from the shop. You're gonna take that money, you're gonna earn it, and then you're gonna go to the trader. Someone's gonna come up to you, turn that money to dirt! What? <laughs> Oh, they're still fighting? Guys, you just got a pile of dirt. Like Johnny Depp from the Pirates of the Caribbean. You just got a, a, a caravan of dirt. Why is the music so mysterious? You're back. Oh, and you have a boo? But a boo's already here with me. Woo! <laughs> oh no, which one is the real abu? I wonder. I'm certainly confused. You are? Really? I bet we can find out the truth with this. Yeah, let me magic both of them. My Abu was actually a goose. <laughs> oh, she's pink now. Alright, I, you know, when I was young. Oh. My Wii Remote was dead, yeah? Yeah, she doesn't talk to me. Okay. Easy. Why is it so quiet? It's unnerving. Oh, what is wrong? My tambourine won't play any sound. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Everyone's like losing senses. Why won't the sailor's instruments make yeah. any sound? Yes, it is strange. But maybe you can fix it. Try waving your wand. I'm sure your magic will help these sailors get their sound back. Either I'm fixing their instruments or I'm fixing their sailors. faulty hearing. We but turn sound to the sailors' musical instrument. Considering I can't hear it too. Okay. Magic. The solution to everything. Ah, my tambourine, it plays music again. <laughs> I love listening to good music. Ah yes. Those beautiful pixels. A human. <laughs> oh, thank you for coming to talk to me. My name's Ariel. <gasps> You're okay. No, no, no. Let's not do the shock. We got both <laughs> red right. hair. Let's I'm let's find a, a connection. Oh, let's I'm not really be shocked. Glad you helped. The sailors aren't the only ones who've lost musical sounds. All the music is gone from the kingdom I live in. I don't think I can go with you underwater. Don't worry. Just use your magic. It will let you breathe underwater. Follow me. Okay, let's just follow an aquatic creature to the bottom of the ocean. Because she tells me music is gone. Definitely. Okay, let's wander around. Ooh, there's a ladder. Oh, we're by the edge of the pond. It's so pretty down here. This way. I wish the actual ocean looked like this. <laughs> He has sent me on a very, very important mission. Stop it! Let me go! Let me go! This is concerning. Okay, sure, I got you. I will free him. Okay, so oh, she's fast. Okay, let's just smack tentacles. That's normal. Okay, let's go. It's just his stare in his beady eyes just concerns me. Ariel and I are trying to find out what's going on. Would you like to join us? Of course, just lead the way. Hey, what's that? Whoa! 
So save the souvenirs. Catch Ariel's treasure <laughs> from the human. <laughs> okay. Do I just stand here? Don't really know. There, there's no commentary needed. I'm saving boots and pots and pans and forks. I wonder what the fairy godmother's doing in the clock tower. I don't know. I guess I should go see her. Okay, let's find out what she's messing with. Let's go! Move! Can we- I see the clock tower, I get it! That's not- okay. Alright, tell me, what what do you do to this poor clock tower? There you are, dear. Are you useful? Well, I'd oh, like she, to help. Oh, do you know uh -oh. where I can find more clocks? I, oh, they're talking. Okay. I see them. Ah, there's no devil! Ah! Oh gosh! And they're talking, and I can't hear them, and they are- Oh, gosh, I accidentally clicked on something. Okay, you're not seeing this on the TV, because I see it on the recording, but I, I clicked off- What? Oh, gosh, okay, well- Oh, okay. Okay, this is kind of- Perish, perish, perish! Oh my goodness! I don't know if it. There's just a clock and it just dissipates into the air and disappears. Like, never. It never happened. We can talk about that. But they're a little murderous, but they're kind, considerate. They ask how you're doing. And then, if you think about it, they just give you a little green junk. Just for free. Whatever this green powder is. They just throw it on you like confetti. Look, look, look! They'll throw it on you like confetti. They stop time for you so you have time to think about your actions in the game. They're not bad guys. Perhaps they are just misunderstood fellows who like to stop time and make pumpkins explode. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going. You know, I if you guys are jobless, I can employ your asses to stop time for me so that when I'm being rushed by someone on the while working at one of my stores and somebody's yelling at me, I can just, you know, stop them. If somebody's yelling, I can just summon you and I'll pay you handsomely. If you would just stop trying to stop time for no reason in this singular spot, you could be hired. You could be employed. Think about the benefits that I provide. They are much better than standing around appearing out of the freaking dirt, the ground. <laughs> I promise you, my benefits are much better. Cinderella at the manor. Cinderella. You haven't solved the problem with time. I know. I think I it's time you get a watch. Ha 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 ha. The clock tower is missing some clocks. And she thinks that might be why time is frozen. Use Amazon. Do you know where I could find three cogs to fix the clock? Use Amazon. Well, you might try looking in the attic. There are all sorts of things. Or you like could go to the marketplace or the, the store. Attic, you might find the pieces missing from the clock tower. Hogs. Find the cogs. Look for the okay. cog at the manor. Why do you guys have the cogs at the manor? If you know where it was, why are you asking for my help? I bet the cogs in the flower pond. Cog. Oh, it's flower. That's kind of cute. Okay, keep turning the mirror on and on. Let's go. We're looking for one cog? Well, I know Gus and Jack like to hide things they found behind the stairs. Oh, would you look at that? In a giant chest. Woo! It'd be so fun if I could just play. Okay, cog. Chest cog, let's go. Watch it not be a cog. Oh. We should go visit the farm next. You never know what the farmer might have. Okay. Let's just hope the farmer has a cog. Oh, jump on the bed. Oh, this game got- I don't know, this- these little things, yay! <laughs> eh, there's not much I can mess with it though, okay, I'm bored now. 
Why is the farmer going to have it? I mean... I'm so sorry to, f to butterflies. I know you're just having fun, you know, stopping time casually. But I got some, um... I got some farmers to bother for their cause. Look guys, I know you're curious as to how I'm doing, but... Uh, I'm okay. I'm just gonna go steal some cogs from a farmer. certain area I can so use that to my advantage if you guys would just let me hire you just get the mice to oh my gosh they're just laughing at us <laughs> they just do their little dance oh that's so cute these poor mice oh god the little mice are just being like thrown around and the music is so calming. There's no urgency for pears. They kind of look like noses. These pears. All these pears look identical. Clearly the graphics just didn't... Okay, it's getting a little... Drop. Okay. Whoa! Ah! Ah! I dropped so many pairs and this hey, man you. still cheers. Wow. I don't suppose this cog the bugs left behind would be of any use to you, would it? Oh wow, you have a cog that we could use? That's so odd. That you had a cog. <laughs> it's almost like I was told to go here. I kinda I think the farmer is my favorite character. Why can't I leave the farm? <laughs> Do I not leave them? Oh, I think I leave them here. Uh oh. No? But how do I get out of here? Wait! What? This. How do I leave? <laughs> okay, there has to be. Okay, there's the way. Out of the four angles that I tried, there had to be one that. The lumber! Leave the lumber in peace! You're like those people that go to somewhere just to bother people. That's what you are. You're an inconvenience. You're not even a bad villain. Farewell, young man. If you won't accept my application for hire, then there's no point in speaking to you. No even directions. We don't get the IKEA directions on how to put this together. We just kind of slap them in there. <laughs> yeah. They were very brave. They helped me get pears. Oh my! Now the time is working again. I hope there's enough of this. The clock was all that we had to fix. Oh no, I got questions for you. everyone. I hope I can come back and visit again. You're welcome back anytime. Oh yes. Do come and visit us again soon. So we saved the wedding and we fixed the clock. Interesting. I gotta say, in the most roundabout way, we fixed the clock by going to a place, going to the attic. No, it was going under the stairs. Then we went to a farm to pick up another cog by saving pears. This is such an odd game. Alright, let's keep going. First is red, like cardinals and roses. Second is green, nature's favorite color. And last is blue, like rivers, waterfalls, and the sky. Lala. So they just. Snow White is just desaturation, I suppose. 
Ooh, what do you gotta say? What's the matter? Are you locked out? This is Joby. He's a friend of Snow White. He beckons me. The little man beckons and I shall follow. <laughs> so fuck you. That fuck you off. Oh. I wish I could be so that my gate could be as jolly. This is oh man. Buckets, barrels, shirt, red. Okay, red shirt, red bucket, red shirt, not red shirt. I'm slowly losing my sanity. So, am I getting blue? Oh, I have blue in my hand. Wait, I need green. What? Ah, uh, yes. Magic. The power of magic! Blue, yellow, and red make that brownish color. <laughs> Two of the gremlins appeared. And this poor guy, he's apparently been fired from chopping wood and is now mining mindless rock. Rock that okay, stop watching me suffer. How do I get up here? Bro, am I just. What? Honestly, I am genuinely confused. How am I supposed to get up here? Oi, that's nature. Just jump it. You're just letting this happen to you? He's shooting green powder at you! This is such a long campaign. Or whatever it's called. Oh, there's just no working with him. <laughs> Help the dwarves work together as a team. But you're mining your own separate I little rocks. You, need your help to work together you don't need to work together. You're mining different rocks. What is the point? What's the point in this? I'm not a music conductor. Just swing that pickaxe round and round. Okay. A mine cart and load up these gems. A steady beat. Employment is difficult in these times, and doing it for free, I suppose, is interesting. Grumpy and Happy are having some more trouble. What? To get the mine cart up the hill, they have to work together in a steady rhythm. Okay. You can help them by pointing your Wii remote at one of the dwarfs and pressing the oh. A button. Then oh. point at the other dwarf and press the A button. I You'll remember. have to alternate pointing at oh. each dwarf until you've filled up the game bar. I remember this. Oh no! See, this this is an actual mini game that makes sense. They're both working together, but the mechanics of this. Oh, it gives me shivers. Just the repetition, the same motion. It's the same motion. The same thing. Um, dark and dopey. Okay, what do I need to do? Why are you guys looking at me? I don't know where to go. Wait, we did the mining. We did. Why are you guys following me? Where do I go? Find me direction. Okay, we're out here. Cool. A help. We were hoping you could help us gather the gems now. Doc and Dopey have to work together to collect the gems, but they'll need your help. help this Dopey is just like the pair game. Gems. Easy and easy. Why is this booty show? Okay. Okay, let's get an actual gem. Mm, an actual gem. 
we go. Gem. What? What? Gem. What is this? No. What? They're so randomized. No. It's like, okay, I expect it to be right here and it just flies. They're just like summoned behind me. Alright, let's just. What? What? No, 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 no. Okay. It seems like harder game mechanics is just luck. <laughs> no! Where are the gems? Wait. No, 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 no. Come on. There we go. Come on. Come on. No! What? How did I miss that? How? How? Come here. There we go. No. That just fell off the world. What do you mean? <laughs> it went just diagonal and not in my bucket. We're very grateful to you, my dear. Wait, why are we going to see it? What has a boob done? Where's the baby monkey? Monkey, where thou does you reside? Where does thou reside? Oh, he was on the stairs! I oh, can I go up the stairs? Oh, can I jump out? Okay. Ooh. Please tell me I got that. Okay. <laughs> that is actually fun. I didn't know you could go up here. Can I jump on me? Oh my goodness. What if I do? I don't care. Alright, let's go. You buying that apple? Oh, they're actually good for once. Hire, I'll hire that bog. For a marketplace, this is very empty. There's nothing lively about the place, except that there's unmoving people. No one would just leave money lying around. Not in this day and age. And there are a lot of them on the way to the Cave of Wonders. It You'll have to fix the Marauder Wouldn't you just touch it and know? About the quest. And good oh luck. gosh. The bogs are going into the economy. Oh, oh goodness boo. gracious. Use your magic on the Marauders. Okay. A oh, boo, no, wait. Please. It's actually... If you just would touch it, it would probably feel like they're not gonna lie. Ooh, a spooky place. I'm sorry, I have to magic your money away, boo. But it's dirt. The things you thought were great treasures were really just piles of dirt. The cave of wonders. What I'm wondering is why I can't have all this money, or is it just dirt? <gasps> all right. What are they gonna do? Turn it to dirt? Oh, they're stealing. Get it. <laughs> Why is this a red-eyed monkey? Green light, go. What in the world? Red light, stop. What if I just don't? Oh, okay. <laughs> Get ready. Green light, go. Green light, go. Red light. This hair flowing is it so natural underwater, I gotta say. So these treasures, they really helped me. I'm just glad I could help. But now that the treasures are safe, I think we should find out what's causing this mess. Help! Ariel! We need your help! <gasps> He's so cute! The whole visit class is on a field trip with Sebastian. Oh, and I love his voice! Oh! <laughs> This little guy is my spirit animal. Oh. Oh, thank goodness you are here. We got to get my star students into the coral where they'll be safe from those music stealing menaces. Oh my god. Do I just 
force them into the bushes. What? Why can't you guys just walk yourself? What? Okay, now I understand why Ariel left. All you had to freaking do, all you guys had to do was walk into these bushes. What is so hard about that? Boom. Bushes you go into the coral, the coral bush. They're tossing the voices into this big pit. Come on, we have to hurry. Oh. <laughs> this just got a, a bit more interesting. That is so disturbing to look at. There they are. The frogs use magic to put the voices into those orbs and they're throwing them off the cliff. We have to catch them before they fall into that bottomless pit. Oh, this is another one of the catching games. I just, I guess I just hit a lot of the catching games for some reason. Move the basket underneath the orb. The meter on the top will fill up. Or maybe they just can't think of any other mini games. Why can't we go to the source of the problem? We send. I say this. We'll save the people's voices from falling into the abyss. But Sebastian needs to go to the root of the problem. And also. Isn't this too much pressure to put on a fish and a little girl? These are people's actual voice. If we just let one fall, aren't we essentially killing a person's voice? I found this shell in the basket with the orbs. Do you know what it is? No, shell. I've never seen it before. Oh, here comes Ariel. We can ask her. Ariel, look! Look at our shell. I'm so glad you found it. This conch shell is very special. What? Why? It belongs to my father. But how did it get here? I don't know. The box must have taken it. Okay. I why. Oh, I'm not sure. We like to blame the things around us together, instead of assuming he might have lost his shell. Oh, look at that lock. Man, oh man, do I have the acute paranoia. The very acute paranoia that I have of just not recording at all and just talking to a blank screen and talking to myself aimlessly. Yes, we're on the surface again, I can breathe. Oh, I'm glad you're back. I found out why those creatures took the conch shell. Why? They stole the sound that belongs inside it. Because this conch shell controls the music of the entire ocean. Why would you if put it in such a bad place then? There'll never be music in the ocean again. How could you let it get <laughs> stolen? And I'm not gonna let it happen. Bro! This place and everybody what did we? But how are we going to get the sound back? Yes. Um. Hello, can you please stop hitting me with the green and stuff? Hit you with the blue stuff? The man without a voice stands by the entrance. Why? Yeah, something's wrong. What is the fence broken? Sebastian. All right, I'm going. With one of my new compositions, I'm gonna remind this shale what beautiful music sounds like. Okay. But first, I got to make sure everyone is in tune. We're tuning people. To help yes. Sebastian tune the band. Point your Wii remote at the group of animals and quickly tap the A button. Um, pressing... that sounds normal. Tune up the band. Let's just. Keep Tap tapping them until they get it right. <laughs> Peer pressure. <laughs> yes. Okay, sing. Oh, I'm supposed to tap them. Okay, hang on. Come on, guys. Let's keep singing. Yep. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, this sounds awful. <laughs> but I guess it'll sound good later. Oh no! <laughs> the ducks. Point your Wii remote at the ducks and press the A button. If you see notes coming from the ducks and then the frog A button, watch the pattern carefully. Oh! Successfully repeat five patterns. Okay. The Can we will be start the concert. This is so annoying.
It was Turtle Frog. Oh, no, not like that. What? You said frog. I. Duck frog turtle, or is it just duck frog? There's another round. Duck. There's another round. This is a kids game. Standards for concerts. <laughs> well, you'll come and visit us again, won't you? Uh, of course. Yeah. In my mm -hmm. I'll always have for sure. together in my heart. Run, little ducks. Let's go. But if I use my magic, we can get all six geese into the pen. Um, okay. Herd the geese into their pen. They aren't sheep, they're geese! And you've already got a locked gate. Why do I need to lead them into a pen? Go to the pen. Young. Young. Go get in the pen. What? Thank you. Now that the geese are safe, we can go find the lamp. <gasps> oh no! What are those? Huh? <laughs> Because Mirage Bogs can hurt you. But if you defeat all the Genie Bogs, the Mirages will go away. And remember to collect the lamps that the Genie Bogs drop when they're defeated. Okay. So, oh. They <laughs> shake! Okay, how much do these guys hurt? Do they hurt a lot more than the other ones? They look like fruits or vegetables. They, they do little jigs. Look at that dance. Hello. It's about time you got here, Abu. Yeah. My mother told me not to talk to strangers. Oh, this child's smart. We're here, but what are we supposed to do with the lamps? Hmm. Play with them. I think we should try placing them on those pedestals. Stack them. Give them to the monkey. Oh. Do you want to place the lamps, Abu? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Abu. I trust you, but we have to work together to place the first lamp. Why? Who will hold up? I want to put it on the other magic pedestal. Lamps. Return the magic lamps to their proper place. But I don't. Why? Wouldn't it be funnier if I just didn't? <laughs> so what if we put the blue one here? No. I want to put it there though. Why is it being so dramatic? Why can't we put the lamps on things there shouldn't be? That was wonderful. Thank you. Agrabah should now be free of the bog's magic. Woo! And the mirages should all be gone. How? How do you know this? Oh my god. I would be a, a fantastic villain in this story. 999? Gems? Wait, wait, wait. Sure, what can I do? I can give you money. Your help. Aren't there seven of you? Seven brains can figure it out. You do not need my brain. I think you'll but regret you even trying to use it. It's not very... Gems lacks intelligence, so... so especially the right with organizing. <laughs> This is not my strong suit. Organization is for the weaklings of the times. I suppose disorganization is a great organization. 
I, I don't know what I'm talking about, if that makes sense. It's like, it's kind of like my brain net now. Things just fall down and just come out. I'll pick them up later. Three in a row that are green. Red. We only get the red and blue gems. The green gems suck. He looks so funny. Um, but his legs are very wobbly. I'm doing good, thanks. I'm gonna go. I'm doing good. Color me surprised because you brushed me the wrong way. That was awful. Take a bush and a thistle because you can paint the colors of the rainbow. Oh! Actual directions! I like you. Thank you. Um. But do not worry, I have persuasion methods, which may not be approved by anyone, really. Um, but I have my ways. Through forceful magic, I will um, do something. I can't walk in the grass for a leisurely stroll. That is lame. What a repetitive guy. Little guy. There's a girl. I don't know. It's butterflies. They're just supposed to be evil incarnate, but isn't that what they are? Evil butterflies? So is it just supposed to be... Well, I guess evil... Evil can be anything in all forms, I suppose. Ooh, evil can be fun! That looks like fun! <laughs> Stealing the colors. Bro, they're just making fun of me! No! Let me at him! It's holding me back. Alright, now I need the... Oh my. What is that walking sound? That is such a weird sound to be walking to. It's like chicken shoes or something. Like rubber chicken as shoes. It's so pronounced. Stealing colors from the animals and from the grow. I can paint them can back. Them mushrooms and butterflies ought to be red. I'm gonna have to think about the rest. Go on and fix them red things and then find me. Oh hey, the shrooms and the flies. You are not a mushroom. Where's the mushrooms? Oh no, you look good in red! And why can't we have red flowers? Oh, that would be fun. She's very presumptuous, the character I'm playing. To just assume she can fix everything. I think that it's like a, po a word positivity, toxic positivity or something like that. We are just so overly positive, but instead of- she can actually back it up though, because she has magical power, so I suppose it isn't that. To the mines we go! <laughs> so, let's see if I can, uh... They just get whiplash. I'm just- I'm like a god in this game, I suppose. Death is not even a possibility. Why even have a health bar if it doesn't even matter? Shouldn't they- oh, the mines aren't this way? Wait, then where are they? Shouldn't the paintbrush guys be more- because you can't take away color with paintbrushes. You you add color with- okay, please guys. Put, I'm stuck in the air. You can't bring color. You can't take away color with a paintbrush, can you? Why is the design of the villain a paintbrush? Oh, I think the mines were- yeah. Shoot. 
The mines work all the way back here. That is so lame. Stop worshipping the, the red beam. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> Why couldn't you get it? You're here! There's some powerful blue magic in the forest. Okay. Maybe that's where you can find the color blue. You can count on me. Okay. <laughs> Get in the mines. Come on, in the mines. No! Where are they going? You guys were all standing around. Couldn't you at least take one for the team and distract the the gremlins? Now all you gotta do is use your magic. Okay. That was quick. <laughs> cool. Ooh, the room's gonna turn something. He laughs Did as he walks away. Into the throne room? Catch him. Catch him. I'm going to I'm going to persuasively tell him never to come here, the elf. <laughs> oh, oh, what? What? Who are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Zara, and you must be the annoying little girl my bog. Okay, that outfit How do first. How you know about the bog? Are you the one causing all this trouble? What? <laughs> oh, I most certainly am. But you see, once upon a time, I too was born a princess, but I refused to learn all those silly. Princess virtues. And just for that, I was banished from my kingdom. But soon. Why is that bad? Didn't you not want to be one? Powers I could use to ruin the worlds of other princesses. And best of all, I can stop any girl from becoming a princess. If I can't be a princess, why should anyone else get a Whoa, be one? whoa, whoa. <laughs> you have ego issues, my friend. Ego issues. What? I don't need it anyway. Screw my voice. What's wrong? <laughs> oh no! Zara must have stolen your voice. <laughs> if it's all those bogs, use your magic to free the sound mask you stole. Who needs vocal cords? No, oh, that did not go as I planned. Now let's see how you do without your wand to save you. Bog, freeze her! <laughs> oh, wait. Your wand. Well, that was a dirty trick. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. No, this actually got interesting. My magic to fix your wand. That is such a cop out. Ah, oh. uh, yes. I did it. I did it. You're free. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow. Thank Thanks, my fairy friend. My phone goes off. Hang on, I need to deal with my phone real quick. Defeat again? Well, I won't stand for it. Bog, steal the colors from this world. <laughs> How is that gonna do anything? Uh oh. It looks like Zara summoning the color bogs to steal the colors from the castle. They succeed. What? Will have even more power. The blue guy did such you a cool flip. The box before they steal all the colors. I want to see okay, him do more flips. Do do that? Oh, now you've made me angry. I'll have to take care of you myself. Yes, come and face me. Zara is greatly weakened. She's calling on the genie box to help her defeat you. Oh no! What should I do? You have to defeat all the genie box. That will stop you. What if we just give her a healing? A nice good slap. A slap so to the far. face. 
Yes, hold my hand. That will make everything better. And it did! Oh, look at that. Yay! Let us all celebrate on the bridge. And hopefully not die. To take your place as a true princess. Oh uh, no, thank you. Princess? I'm okay. But... Oh, I remember now. What? What? That looks not normal. Can we not do that, please? Ariel looks so out of place. Everyone looks uncomfortable. Can we undo? That was the game? Papaya Studios. All right, let's see this clean castle now. Who owns this castle? And why have not people been maintaining it? I wonder what's going to be your problem, to which I solve. Ooh, mother calls. Um, not much. Uh, I'm so old. I need to use the handrails at 18. Bye. Bye. Uh oh. Don't make fun of her. She's just kind of standing there. What are those green creatures? Okay, there? I kind of want to make fun of her too. She's just standing there. Mademoiselle, I have never seen them before. They just appeared out of nowhere. They do not seem harmful, but I would not want the master to see them. Who knows what he might do? To the Lord, this sound is driving me insane. I think the bugs want to play a game of tag. <laughs> Why are we playing with them? Okay. I guess they're not evil anymore. Whoever made the bog sound. Okay, who's it? Are they it? I'm running. Whoever made the bog sound, I have a real agenda against. That is so annoying! Why are they so fast? This is a very odd game. Is that it? That... It was just running around a room. I thought I was supposed to tag them back. I think you should try using the different colored wands. Use the red wand for the red piece. The green... Anyways. Uh, uh, 